Good morning, my love. Did you sleep so good this morning? Did you have a little lay in? Oh, good morning. <laughs> This is the milk that Ava drinks now, now that she is almost 13 months, and she drinks it out of a straw cup, so no more formula and no more, no more baby bottles, huh? Yeah, you like your milk, huh? And she just drinks it cold now, straight out of the bottle. This is typically where we will relax, she'll have her milk, and then we'll probably play for the next hour, hour and a half. Um, and then I'll make her her breakfast. You ready for some breakfast? It is just past 9 a.m. now. We were on the phone with her Nana, and that's how we spend some of the time when we got some time to kill. So she spoke to her Nana for an hour, probably. Um, now it's time to make some breakfast about an hour and a half after she woke up so yeah so Ava's favorite breakfast right now is baby pancakes and it's just half a banana and one egg and that's it and it's super easy to make and while I am making her food I will usually just give her a few puffs just to keep her happy And while she is eating, this is when I will unload the dishwasher and just clean up the kitchen a little bit, huh? After breakfast is when I will go get her all cleaned up and changed into her clothes for the day. So I just did a cute little ponytail on the top of her head and I thought I'd show you what I use and this is like, it's like baby hair gel. It's not very strong, but it kind of gives you just a little bit of grip on the hair. Uh, I can't believe how much, how long her hair has gotten now. Hey, you look so pretty. No, no, don't pull it. I know. So now that Ava has had her breakfast, it's about 9.45, almost 10. Since she woke up at 7.30, she will go down for her nap at 12.30, about five hours, five to six hours after she wakes up in the morning. And she is down to just one nap a day now. Um, and that nap will be about two hours to two and a half hours. And then she's awake for five hours after her nap before she goes to bed. And that seems to be her new routine now. It's what's working for us and what's working for her. So like I said, she will go down for her nap at 12.30. From now till then, we pretty much just play. Um, if it doesn't rain, we will go for a nice little walk around the neighborhood and she loves that. But pretty much we're just gonna play. Keeping a toddler entertained for long periods of time is way different than just trying to entertain a baby who can sit still. Now she is just into everything and walking all around the house at all times. 
Is that a big truck? Yeah. All right, now that she's walking so well, I had to get her cute little Converse. I mean, come on, is that not the cutest thing you've ever seen? So I just remembered that I gotta brush this little one's teeth. I'm trying to get into the habit and get her into a good habit. I know she's only little and only young, but good habits can start early. So I got her this cute little toothbrush and toothpaste Hi. set that came together. Hi. Yeah, you gonna brush your teeth? Yeah, like that. Do you want to put a little bit of toothpaste on? Yeah, good job. Yeah, just like that. Good girl. You want to try and do it yourself? Yeah. <laughs> it is almost 11, so I'm just taking this little one out on our little morning walk since the weather is really nice. It's cool and windy, so it's a perfect time to go for a walk. Okay, we made it home without getting too wet. She goes mad for these go-go squeezes, so I'm gonna give that to her as a snack. And yeah, it's now 11 o'clock, so she'll have this, and then I will give her some more food around 12, and then she will have some milk around 12.30 before she goes down for her nap. Is that good? Yeah, it's yummy, huh? I can have Good job, baby. 11.30 now and I'm starting to get really hungry and can't wait until she goes down for her nap. <laughs> so I'm gonna make myself some breakfast and I'm gonna give her some as a little snack as well. Can you give me a kiss? Good job, I love you. We just finished eating and now Ava has about 45 minutes before she goes down for her nap. Here we are just gonna play a little bit until then. So she's having a little bit of milk before her nap. I don't expect her to finish all of that, but whatever is left over, I will put back in the fridge. Okay, so it is 10 past two and I'm hearing Ava wake up now. So she slept for about an hour and 40 minutes. She usually will sleep longer than that, between like two and two and a half hours, but she did wake up late and she slept really good last night. So she probably just wasn't as tired, but I'm gonna go get her up now. Hi, baby. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Now it's time to make her some lunch. So because she woke up at 10 past two, her bedtime will be 10 past seven. Yeah, 10 past seven, five hours after she wakes up from her nap. And tonight she is gonna have a bath and everything like that. For lunch, I'm gonna make her some whole wheat toast with butter and, yeah, and strawberry jam. And I've got some leftover, <laughs> some leftover honeydew melon that I'm gonna give her as well. Is it yummy?